Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Gabe's to here. We are back with some more Naxxramas action. This is the Shaman class challenge against Gothic the Harvester. So uh, you can see that your deck is going to be a lot of uh, big taunts and then some gimmicks to try to play around his main ability. Uh, reincarnate's probably not that useful early on. I think I'll hang on to Hex though. So, you'll see that Gothic basically draws a lot of cards, but the main thing is he'll summon minions that when they die, they summon a minion on your side. So here's one. So this will summon a trainee, which has zero attack, so it can't innately attack, but um, it also does one damage to your hero every at start of every turn. So you got to watch for these minions. So there are a couple ways to deal with it. Um, the other thing is he'll summon a lot of dudes that have death rattles that explode in some way. Um, hmm. what to do here? That's an okay hex target considering my mana curve, but he does play bigger minions than that. Probably totem rock biter into that. Hmm. Getting the taunt is sometimes not good since he's forced to kill it. And often you want him to ignore your minions so you can buff them. But I don't have any other buff cards, so it's, it's alright. Anyway, so here you can see the summoned uh, minion. In this case, it's the trainee, so it just does one damage. Ah, see, if I hadn't gotten the taunt totem. I probably would have two minions alive and they could kill that. But anyway, this is your main crutch to utilize the trainees with stuff like Flame Tongue. Um, in any event, I don't want him to kill this with this minion, so I'm just gonna kind of waste my turn a little bit. Alright. Looks like Lightning Storm is pretty good here. No matter what, it clears the board. Um, because it will do three damage minimum to this, and when this dies, it will do one more to that. So we'll go with that, and then probably play Spiders, I think, or Flame Tongue. Okay. Positioning does matter a lot, but not this turn. So I have three of these dudes now. I'm going to take three damage at the start of the turn. So that's really what you got to watch for. But it's not too difficult. You just take your time. Think you got forever. <laughs> so think through all your turns. Reincarnate. Uh, not so good here, but great with Sylvanas. But that'd be two turns from now. I think I'll just activate my minions and trade in. And totem. I could summon a 4 4, but it's not the best use since this would reduce my damage taken next turn by two. Uh, whereas using these two would only reduce it by one. There's the the biggest thing he'll summon that summons in a spectral for you. So that's a pretty good hex target. Ah, another activator. That's nice. Okay. Uh, I can't imagine a better hex target time, so I think I'll do it here. And buff these two with Argus. It's 
kind of a bad... Eh, that's questionable to Argus here. It activates this, which is important, but this is only going to activate... The Flame Tongue is only going to activate one minion if uh, the Creeper and the little summons get killed. Anyway, so here's the... More of those things that do damage when they die. He really likes those. So I have to plan this appropriately. I think I want to reincarnate Sylvanas to steal this minion. But I need room to do it. I mean, I could just not have any space and have the Abomination kill itself, I suppose. Uh, yeah, okay, that's fine. So I want to kill this one first. Oh, no, wait, I can't use the spiders because they'll explode. Or this will explode and then kill this off and I'll get two more minions. So I have to use... I could use this and this. And then I would have room for Sylvanas. Is this will die. So now I get the abomination as well. Okay. Kill off Sylvanas. And then we'll take that and get Sylvanas back. Okay. Pretty good. All right, so you just have to think about attack order at this point. Uh, it doesn't really matter that much. I want to use the things that are going to die the explosion no matter what. I might want to buff this up. Oh, wait, I can't. Eh. Well, I could. I can attack in with one of these. Then it clears my space up to like an Argus. But really, I'm overthinking it. The key is just not to use the A bomb, because it'll explode. Two explosions will murder everything. Anyway, so I'll use that. And then I'll Argus that. And then kill that. And it doesn't matter. Alright. Well, there you go. So overall, pretty easy challenge. Um, really, it's it's kind of a cool little training for dealing with death rattles. Particular death rattles that affect the entire board. So, as always, thanks for watching, and see you next time.